Shout out Fuchsia's TV, first of all. But what you think about that top 20? Is it top 20? Top 20 best Riley artists. No, top 10. I don't know. It's one of them. Um... And and, and and I and I I know I, I know two well and I know a few people up there, but um and shout out Future is Fetty because they put Fetty up there. Yeah, Fetty and Marley. shout out to Marley. Shout out to oh, Marley, Marley, Marley up there the, too. Shout out to uh, Nia, the plug daughter. Shout out to all the artists that made it really. But I always wonder um is the list about talent or is it about clout? You know what I mean? Because as far as like artists with. I know a lot of more. I know a lot of artists with better ability than the people that they had on the list. So, so you're saying it's more about clout. Yeah, I'm saying that list can't be about the most talented artists. I guess hot. When you say hot, you say clout. Hot and clout must be like two interchangeable words. Okay. okay. And shout out to Southside too. Oh, yeah, and, and that nigga like that nigga put in been putting in so much work since he came home. Man, I'm so proud of that nigga. Like. That is the perfect example of what I was talking about with the military. When he got out, he knew he was all in on this shit. This all he got. So he all in on it. You know what I mean? That nigga, every time I wake up, that nigga got a new video. Yeah, Southside is working. Southside works. Every time that nigga Kimmo got a new video. You know what I mean? Yeah, Southside. And that nigga is in the trenches, for real. You yeah. know what I mean? Do you feel like you should have been on that list? Um, if the If the list is about clout, hell no. Yeah, if it's yeah. about popularity, hell no. But if it's about <laughs> talent, I'm number one on the list. Yeah. You know what I mean? Yeah. But it's not about that because I would have made the list if it was yeah. about that. Okay. okay, okay, okay. I don't really listen to... Everybody know I'm like a... Uh, I listen to all genres of music. I'm not really big on rap because rap don't got a lot of substance in it anymore. I'm People, really not either, man. Yeah. I'm really not either. I, I feel depressed when I listen to rap. Yeah. A half the time, I'm more depressed listening to Rapper make you depressed because all people do is um, I've been to studios where I've seen the inner workings of an artist. Like I've seen a nigga with all the new lingo written on a page, like thirty oh, sticks. Yo, I've seen a nigga write down all the lingo and incorporate it in his music. That's nothing but I'm not gonna lie. To like, sound. Lingo. No, no, it's a great tactic. And he done did his homework. It, it is, it's a great tactic, but shit, you, I mean, damn. I, I, I think I didn't thought about that, but not had done it. You know what I'm saying? That, that take a lot. Yeah, yeah. What, what I'm saying is, it's more so like, anybody can be a rapper nowadays because it's not about if you did it or not. It's about selling it. You know what I mean? Yeah. It's not about the substance or the feeling you get off, give off as if, it's more so, can I make this shit look good? You know what I mean? That's what it's about. If I get on the track and I'm saying all the new lingo that you know, like, you know what I mean? Whatever the whatever motherfucker's saying, you know what I mean? Whatever the new shit is out, whatever the new dance is out, if I incorporate that in my music, whether I'm about that or not, mm -hmm. as long as I can sell it, I'm selling it. And that's what I had to grow to understand that it's not about, at this point, when you're coming up out of the ground, it's not about talent. It's about building a brand. You got to, you have to become almost like a movie character. It's like rap is like wrestling. You have to, you have to create an image and you have to sell the image, whether it's real or not. Right, now listen, all right. can you can you can you kind of explain uh, the, the you, you 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 checked yourself into a mental hospital? Oh yeah 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 yeah. I, um. I've always had this ability to um, to I could look at someone. I'm not like a fortune teller or nothing, but I've always had this ability to know how people feel and know what type of people people are so fast that it started to fuck with me. You know what I mean? <laughs> it started to make me feel like either I'm tripping or I was crazy or. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And, and along with having anxiety, social anxiety anyway, um, it it drove me to a point where I was just like, maybe I should go see somebody. You know what I mean? Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> maybe I should go check some people out. Mm -hmm. And um, and I did that. And it was one of the greatest experiences of my life. I don't really give a damn how people uh, 
look at psych wars or, you know what I mean, mental hospitals, whatever you want to call it. Um, one of the greatest experiences in my life, I, I met some people I'll never forget, and it made me realize that when I got in there and started talking to my therapist and stuff like that, they would end up talking to me more about their problems than I would talk to them. So it, it, it was like, it was great. It was a great experience. I, I don't regret doing that at all. You know what I mean? And some of those people I still keep in contact with to this day. That's dope, bro. Some people, yeah. some people wouldn't even talk about that, that side. Of yeah. Life. I swear that. It was um when I went. It was like three days before the uh, Dundale Block Party, and they would they was playing my music on SoundCloud <laughs> in the facility at Wakebrook, not not at Holly Hill, but across the street at Wakebrook. They was actually playing the music, and that was that was it was just crazy, man. It was crazy. That's kind of dope, though, bro. Yeah, it it, it was. It was Did you, crazy. Were you walking around in a gown and shit like that? Like, no, no, it, it wasn't no gown thing. We um. We had, uh, it was like, did we have scrubs or something? It, it, it won't like, it ain't like what you think. Well, really, we have regular clothes, really. 